Carlos Diaz. <laughs> we are at the airport right now, waiting for our flight to Minneapolis. Flipia. We're so excited. We're really excited. I'm very excited. Freddie planned out our whole itinerary the same day that we booked our flights. Awesome. <laughs> if you didn't watch my packing vlog for Minneapolis, then you may not know why we're going. Why are we going? To get drunk. Yes. Yes. <laughs> you need a nap. Um, we're going to just check out the city because we've never been before. And to get out of Satan's butthole, which is Phoenix in the summer. Oh dear. Yep. Yeah. So that's why we're going. It's the weather's gonna be really nice and humid and in the 80s. It'll be great. Your curls are gonna frizz up so much. Yeah. Have fun with that. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, we're excited. We've got Nothing like major on the agenda outside of Mall of America because duh. It's not even the That's the thing I'm least excited for. That's the for. thing I'm most excited for. Oh. <laughs> like do you know me at all? Anyways, so yeah, we're gonna check out some fun restaurants, an arboretum, local bookstores, get some more books. Because I always need more books. And yeah, just hang out. Party. Party. Party rock. Okay, so I always, even if I bring books to read on the plane, I always want to buy a magazine too, just because it feels like the right thing to do. So I'm so excited with what I got. People 90s edition. <laughs> so excited on the back, in sync. Oh, are the Backstreet Boys in here? Oh, I just flipped open to the boy band page. Yeah, our flight's about like three hours. And I'm gonna, I brought some books to read too, so I need to try to get some good reading time in and not fall asleep. Books? Yeah, I brought two books. I'm being you overly need to optimistic. Read some books. That makes no sense. I need to read shorter books so I can read more of them. No, you need to read some like eight, nine hundred pages. Mm -hmm get on my level. No. No, thank you. All right, well, I'm going to keep drinking my Starbucks, dive into a little bit of this magazine, and see you in Minnesota. See you in Minnesota. minutes early and we didn't have a really great window seat situation so I couldn't film landing because the window was like positioned a little bit behind me <laughs> um, but that is okay so we are it's like almost two o'clock now yes yeah, like 2 Michael Kerr. So yeah, we're gonna go get some lunch. Well we're gonna go to the hotel first and see if we can check in. I think we should be able to and then get some lunch because yeah. we're hungry. We didn't eat any lunch yet. We just had like a breakfast sandwich at Starbucks. And that's it. Then that's it. We'll see. We'll see what we end up doing later today. Side effects include low red blood cell and low platelet counts, infections, tiredness, nausea. to our room and it's so cute. I love the t like subway tile in the shower. Okay, but wait. A rotary phone. We do? Yeah. I'm gonna go up on my bunk bed. <laughs> Are you gonna sleep up there? Maybe. Maybe? Oh, oh okay. Don't break it. <laughs> okay, good night. That's like a cute little reading loft. That's yeah, really so is. cute.
Look, I feel like we're in a cabin or something, even though we're in the middle of a city. And then we've got a Jimmy John's right on the corner. Not that we're gonna go there. Oh, and a Trader Joe's right there. This is a cute little room. I like it. Me too, I approve. <laughs> Wednesday and we just finished getting ready to head out for some coffee and breakfast. I don't know where I should look. Should I look here or here? I don't know. Um, <laughs> so um, this is my outfit for today. Let me zoom out. There we go. Um, so I've got my clueless tee on and my Daggy Dover fanny pack. Um, I made well jeans and my little new Reformation sneakers. Come here, come show people your outfit. Freddie is in his 80s dad outfit, as we call it. Um, yeah. What brand is your shirt? I don't know. Oh, okay. Well, we got it from Nordstrom and you're wearing AG shorts from Nordstrom as well. And your new Albert sneaks. Those are so cute. Look at those calves. Yeah, nice. Oh man, all the muscle. <laughs> oh my. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go check out, um, there's a bookstore that we wanna look at called Moon Palace and they supposedly have coffee there, but we don't know if they serve food. You and don't know what I'm saying. We want food. Um, so we might rent bikes over there. Just depends. We're gonna go check out the lift bikes and see what the situation is. Um, but slept really good last night after a very long and early travel day. So feeling ready What's to up? adventure. It's coming. What are they driving? So cute. All right. We just got coffee. This it's very tasty. Yeah, it was really good at this place called Penny's. And um, we just sat outside and read for a little while, which was really relaxing. It's a beautiful breeze. Yeah, we sat in the shade and the breeze was really nice. It was like back in this little office building here. Um, and yeah, we just sat down for like an hour and a half, probably. Yep. Almost two hours, I don't know. And now we're going to a concert later. Yeah, we're gonna go to this like restaurant that um, has this, what's the guitar? Slide guitar? Slide guitar. Yeah, he's a slide guitarist and he's playing at this restaurant. 
So we like reserved a table. He's from England. He's from England. And we're gonna go there in a couple hours and go have dinner and watch him perform. So we're excited to do that. And I feel like I need to shower again before we go out because we rode bikes earlier and I was sweating a lot. <laughs> so I feel really gross, but. I'm not going to. You're not going to? Nope. All right, well. So we just had dinner at, is it just called Dakota? The Dakota. The Dakota. Okay. That's how you know they're fancy. They put a the. The. The Dakota. Oh, you want to go this way or go this way? Well, let's go straight. Okay. So yeah, we went to the Dakota because there was this musician named Jack Broadbent. Broadband. Like internet. Wait. Broad... What? I think it was Broadband. No, I thought it was Broadbent. Well, that was uh. one Broad something. Jack to be confirmed later. TBD. <laughs> um, but he was so good. So he, I think I mentioned this a little bit earlier, but he does um, string, what is it called? Oh my God, I'm so Slide wow. guitar. Slide guitar, Gosh. He uses a whiskey flask. Yeah, he uses a whiskey flask on the strings to make a really cool sound effect. It was awesome. And he, Jazz and blues. Jazz and blues. He played some cover songs, which was cool, and some of his own music, obviously. Um, the food was really, I thought it was good. Freddie thought it was like, all right. It was all right. Um, not bad, had, just not like amazing. I had a corn chowder that had crab and shrimp in it and it was yummy. And we had cheddar biscuits and you had some deviled eggs that you liked. De the deviled eggs were very good. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it was overall a really fun time. I'm really glad we Super did it. Fun. Yeah, it was just like a very cool experience. So I'm glad that we did it. And it feels amazing outside and we're walking back to our hotel. Yep. And yeah. Okay, good that's stuff. it. Okay. Good, good ending. Signing off. <laughs> good morning. Good morning. <laughs> we need to wake up. Yeah. I don't need caffeine because we're going to the Mall of America today! <laughs> I'm so excited. Yeah. I feel like I've been waiting for this day for my whole life. <laughs> what? I said I feel like I've been waiting for this day my whole life. Oh. I'm extra excited though because my friend Ashley is here um, on like a work trip and she has some free time this morning before her conference starts so we're gonna go together so we're going to a coffee shop right now to meet up with her and then we're gonna take an uber to the mall and go shopping and i'm so excited Kind of heavy. It's probably going to be expensive. 
It is what it is. Okay. YOLO. <laughs> What you getting? Peanut butter. Peanut butter. I should have known. Cookie? Yep. Yep. And that's it. That's it? Yep. Satisfied with your bag? I am. <laughs> look at my hair. Hey, look at those curls. Having a good hair day. Yeah, I really am. Yeah. Got to savor the moment. <laughs> So we are at, um, what is this, Mills Park? Yeah. General Mills Park? Not General oh. Mills, Mill, no, but it said... Mill Ruins Park, right there. Yeah, but if you look right there, it says General Mills Plaza. Not as in the cereal brand, but... Uh, Probably as in the cereal brand. You think? Yeah. Did General Mills originate here? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, we're in the I Mill... I think headquartered here, actually. Oh, okay. We're in the mill district, which is like the flour district, like flour as in baking flour. And we're sitting in front of, or yeah, in front of the Mississippi River, which I've never seen before in real life. It's so cool. Yeah, I think it's really cool. Um, I think and those are the cataract falls. I think so, that we read about on the sign. So yeah, we're just chilling here. We um, went to Mall of America earlier and I thought it was a really fun experience. The mall is massive, which I anticipated going into it. Um, I enjoyed it. Yeah, there was a Nickelodeon themed theme park in the middle of the mall and it was way bigger than I expected it to be. There were like three roller coasters, a Ferris wheel, a bunch of other rides, like as you're walking through it, it just like keeps going and you're like wait there's so many rides in here it was really cool i was very tempted to go on a few but it was kind of expensive it was like eight bucks to ride the ones that i wanted to go on and i was like per ride oh. yeah per ride and i was like you know i don't need to go on them that badly <laughs> so i will live if i don't um but yeah it just felt like a really big like 90s mall you know nothing I don't know, is it bad to say nothing that special? <laughs> like, all the stores that we have at home were there, so it wasn't like there were any unique stores that we like hadn't seen before, um, but it was still fun. Like, I'm really glad we went, because I've always wanted to go to Mall of America, and we, we did, so it was cool. I was living up my Mary-Kate and Ashley vibes from that one little home video movie they did at Mall of America, <laughs> when they were like, I don't know, 10 years old or something so anyway we are just chilling here for a bit in the shade and then tonight um well pretty soon actually we're gonna go to uptown which is like this barcade and play some vintage arcade games i want to play pac-man that's all i really care about and get some yummy food do they have like is it just bar food like i have no idea mm -hmm. all right we'll find out when we get there so our outfits today it's raining this is my outfit and if you don't like it it's some real or something oh, okay um yeah it's raining today and it's like in the 60s so i'm gonna be cold i know that for sure but that's okay we're gonna go get breakfast and go to some museums well one yeah. museum for sure little city museum mm -hmm. all about the flower flower 
<laughs> it's so windy right now. Feels good. I'm cold. Why am I so cold? It's like not even that cold. Feels good. I like it. I should have brought a sweatshirt. A <laughs> button your jacket. That's weird. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, well, I might have to it's though. It's a nice, easy breezy 68 with a big wind. No, it's 63. 63 with a big wind. That's a big difference. Well, feels good to me. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. I'm glad. I'm so happy for you. Good. You should be. <laughs> Get the flower on your head, you know, and you put it on your shoulder. You're gonna be just soaked with sweat. Just like flour with the water, make it just comb your wrist to get the goo balls out. home not really <laughs> we um yeah our flight this morning was at like 11 30 and we landed around noon gotta love time change going back in time what do you rate the city i seven out of ten that's yeah that's freddie's rating for minneapolis i would say i yeah i would say about the same like it was really cool i'm really glad we went um mm -hmm. Downtown felt like um, a little quiet or a lot quiet, I guess, which was, you know, kind of cool because there's not a lot of people around. Kind of weird though. Kinda yeah. Eerie. Yeah. A little eerie at times, but we were talking about this at dinner last night. We went to this place called Tavola. It's an Italian restaurant inside the, I think it's called the Elliott Hotel. Um, and we were talking about our favorite meals that we had. What was your favorite meal that you said you had? I don't know. You don't remember? Maybe Tavola. Yeah, it was really good food. We ordered some appetizers. Like we had fried polenta and meatballs and... Mm, meatballs. What was that bread thing called? It was steak tartare. Oh, steak tartare. Yeah, with like this flat bread with olive oil drizzled on top. It was so good. Um, but our favorite dessert was Edward's Dessert Kitchen. It was so cute. A bomb. Amazing dessert. Like, we wanted to go again last night, but it was, like, out of the way from where we were at for dinner. And we had walked so much yesterday, and we were just like, no. Couldn't bring ourselves to do it. So, um, but we did it once, which was great. Um, and you guys, this Blockbuster shirt is quite the conversation starter. <laughs> I had three people on the flight home say something right. about it. And I was like, yeah, Blockbuster, good times, right? <laughs> I thought it was funny. So really glad I got this shirt. It's from Abercrombie. I will link it in the description in case you would like to get it also. It's a men's shirt, so I got it in an extra small. And it's still like a looser, looser fit, which is really comfy. So yeah, this is like the only thing I got on our trip, actually. 
Did I buy anything else? I don't think so. Socks. Socks. We went to Allbirds. They had an Allbirds store in downtown. I bought socks. Freddie got some cool running shirts mm -hmm. and just casual t-shirts that were on sale, which was cool. So yeah, I walked out pretty empty handed from Mall of America, which I was very proud of myself for because I thought it was going to be quite the opposite. Would you go back to Minneapolis? Um, I think I would. I yeah. Would. I want to go to St. Paul because we didn't go to St. Paul. Yeah. And that's the other twin in the phrase twin cities. I'll go during the winter. Oh, in the snow? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'd be fun. Yeah. Oh, wait, what'd you think of the Mill City Museum that we oh, went to yesterday? Oh, that was so fun. <laughs> oh, man. That was such a good museum. Yeah. It really was just top-notch. Mm-hmm. Very interactive. Very informative. I appreciated it so yeah. much. It was a really awesome experience, and it was really close to our hotel, like a five-minute walk. Um, and it was this mill factory that was owned by General Mills. And we learned that Minneapolis was like the top producer of flour in the world at one point. Um, and they turned it into a museum in 2003 after the mill caught fire three separate times because as we learned, flour dust plus oxygen plus a spark equals big flame explosion. It's not a good combo. Yeah. But it was very cool. They had this really awesome, it was called the Flower Tower. And it was this um, freight elevator that had like st little stadium seats in there, like four different rows where you sat down. And um, our tour guide was so cute. He was this older man who was like so into his job. And you could tell he loved it there and was like very just exciting to like tell the history of the mill. And you went up and down between nine like different floors. And they had like little sets set up and like told you the story of people who worked at the mill. It sweet. And it was just so cool. I felt like I was at Disneyland. Like it was really good quality in terms of storytelling and just how they had it all set up. So I was very impressed. Mm -hmm. It was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. All in all, it was a really great trip. And we will go Would back. Would recommend. Would recommend. We'll go back eventually. So. Thanks for watching this Minneapolis travel vlog and see you all again really soon. Ta-ta. Bye.